We all have seen movies like E.T., Star Trek etc. We know it's just plain science fiction, but what if it were for real? Can life really exist beyond Earth? Scientific research has shown that there are certain entities in our own solar system which have elements necessary for the origin of life. Welcome to Lab 360, it's time to explore. According to data collected by NASA's Cassini mission, an international team of researchers have discovered phosphorus, an essential element for life on Enceladus, a moon of Saturn. Scientists say there is evidence of abundant phosphorus in the water geysers that routinely blasts into space from this particular moon and there is a high possibility of existence of life on this natural satellite. Phosphorus is the foundation for DNA, which forms chromosomes and carries genetic information. It is present in the bones of mammals, cell membranes, and plankton living in the ocean. Phosphorus is also a fundamental part of energy-carrying molecules present in all forms of life on Earth. It is impossible for life to exist without it. Besides phosphorus, Enceladus is an ice-clad moon that has an enormous ocean of liquid water underneath an icy crust. Scientists previously found other key building blocks of life in the moon's ocean such as carbon, hydrogen, nitrogen, sulfur, and oxygen. The researchers claim that the high phosphate concentrations are a result of reactions between the carbonate-rich liquid water and rocky minerals on the moon's ocean floor. Though life has not been found on Enceladus or anywhere else in the solar system beyond Earth, having these key elements is necessary. But even that might not prove to be sufficient for an environment to sustain extraterrestrial life. However, the biggest question that remains is whether life can originate in Enceladus's ocean? With the availability of the six building blocks of life, scientists are theorizing that there is an enormous possibility that life will thrive on this moon in the future. When we let the five crucial elements, carbon, hydrogen, oxygen, nitrogen and phosphorus combine, we get nucleic acids like DNA. Deoxyribonucleic acid or DNA is a polymer that carries genetic instructions for the development, functioning, growth and reproduction of all known organisms. So, what has been discovered on Enceladus seems to be the beginning of the formation of life. Maybe, a few billion years later, we may see life there just like how it is on Earth right now. We could soon be saying hi to new forms of extraterrestrial lives on Saturn's moon. Do you think Enceladus really supports life? Do you think there is a possibility of finding life or traces of it in the near future? Do share your thoughts in the comments section below. And be sure to subscribe to Lab360 for the latest revelations in space exploration. Hit the bell icon to stay updated and let's continue to explore together.